One of the nice features of MYOB that will help you run your business more smoothly and maybe more efficiently is the contact log. If I click on contact log, it opens up an area where I can store notes about my suppliers and customers, reminders of things that I may need to pursue. So for example, I may have rung my customer and said, you're a little bit overdue with the payment, when can I expect it? And he may tell you, oh, I'll send you a payment by such and such a date. In which case, all I would need to do is to put in the customer's name at the end of the conversation, and I'm going to create a new contact log to remind me when I need to be on my toes and ringing him up and saying what happened to it if he hasn't paid me. So I can put in there a note that says payment promised. And payment promised and what date? If I rang him a week ago and he may say I'll pay you on Friday, okay, I would make the recontact date the Monday, allowing him to pay it on the Friday and it reached me on the Monday on the bank account on the Saturday or Sunday, and I'll recontact him on the Monday, the 23rd of July. So I've got payment promised etc. I could put in the contact name if I wanted to record exactly who I spoke to. If I know my customers well, I probably know who I'm speaking to. And I click record and payment promise goes in there with a recontact date. If I close that, when I come into work on the 23rd and I click on my to-do list, if it doesn't open automatically, it's one of the options I have, if I click on the to-do list and look at the contact alert, I can see up there that I'm due to call my customer on the 23rd. If I want to find out what it's about, click on the white arrow and it will say payment promised. I then have to go back into my bank account. Did I receive the payment from him as promised? And if I didn't, pick up the phone. G'day, where's my money? A very useful little tool to make sure you stay on top of whatever it is. You could use this when people have asked you for quotes or you've sent quotes out and asked for a recontact date. When do I get back to you about it? There is nothing worse than having a possible customer who's got the quote, is all ready to go ahead and then decides to go with somebody else. This sort of thing can help you run your business more efficiently. When I finish calling him up, cancel, with any further notes, and I'll close, and we're back to the main card file job center. The other thing I can do in here is to print mailing labels. I may want to send out end of year calendars to all my suppliers and all my customers, that sort of thing. Or I may want to send out fresh information about maybe I'm having to move, etc. If I click on print mailing labels, I've got a list of all the people I want to send the information out to. In this case, it will just be my customers and my suppliers. I'm not going to send one out to the cash sales. And if I then click print, it'll ask me which printer, etc. It will then print labels to all my customers and suppliers, which I can then stick onto a pre-printed card with any new contact details I might wish to send them or envelopes with maybe a newsletter about what's happening in my business. A useful tool to keep in contact with both customers and suppliers.